I'm Katrina and this is So and Tear. Welcome to the week in review for the week of October 17, 2022. We had a interesting week this week and here are some pictures and videos to show you what's been going on. Meatball just hopped out of the of the uh, nest box. Are you just checking it out or are you having babies? Hmm? No babies yet. Are you just checking it out? Alright. What about you, Tortellini? Hmm? No babies yet. Alright. Good girl. Meatball is in the nest box. Hi, Meatball. Did you have babies? Hi, sweetie. How are you? How are you? Let's see here. Well, I don't see any. Thought maybe she would cover him up. Sammy, no babies yet, huh? No babies yet? All right, Tortellini looks like she was in her nest box too. Hi. Oh, hello, honey. Hello. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> All right, let's see what's in your nest box. Mm, you flattened it. I don't see any, any fur though, so I think we're good on that. All right, honey, you did prepping, huh? So this went on all week and um, I finally got out the stethoscope. Hi. Alright, so in health class in high school they gave us a stethoscope. Let's see if I can hear anything in her belly. I'm not a doctor at all, but maybe I could hear something. Come here, honey. There you go. All the way. Let's try that. <laughs> well, I hear a gurgly tummy. Oh, come here, sweetie. I'm just listening. I don't know what I can tell. Let's check on Tortellini. Alright, baby, come here. Come here. Good girl. Good girl. Oh no, guys, I don't hear any little heartbeats. I hear her heartbeat. I don't think they're pregnant. We'll wait a couple more days, but I don't think they're 
pregnant. I'll have to listen to them when they are pregnant just to see. I forgot I had this. Looks like we're starting to get more moisture. This is powdery mildew, which I can have the animals eat later. These zucchini leaves with powdery mildew. We can just feed them to the animals. <laughs> She's jumping for them. <laughs> they don't care, sweetie. I just hope you're not doing this. Are you doing the same thing to the quail? Hmm? Hi. You don't live here. You don't. If you're going to be here, though, can you catch some rats? I believe in you. You can catch rats. I had a marathon multitasking kitchen day after work one day, which resulted in this much canned foods and then also some uncanned stuff like this. So out of that one day, I have multiple videos that I did for the individual things, not all of the things I did, but for some of them. And also just a how to multitask video. Um, I think that will be handy for people to see. And I get asked a lot how you do it all. And so I'll have a video on that at some point. So this is what beans look like after you put them in the fridge um, and you've used bone broth to make them instead of water. They're a little gelatinous -y which is really good, has lots of nutrition in it. And you can heat this up and can it, or you can keep it in the refrigerator, or you can put it in the freezer. Any of those will work. This is black beans. The pineapple guava tree has been giving and giving and giving, and the second one hasn't even started. So we are having a fantastic pineapple guava season. There's a whole bunch down here. And a couple ones over here and look how giant that one is. <laughs> that is a big one. Stepping on the grass. I, just, the I just stepped on that one. Yeah. Probably the cat. I would lay there if I was a cat. You want to? That one. That's more the size you're going to see in the store if your store has one. The passion fruit and the passion flowers have been catching everybody's eye. I've had several people walking by comment on how beautiful they are, which is pretty cool. And they are also tasty. Quail are nearly recovered from being scared by a raccoon, and so that's good. These are some of the things I harvested to get ready for our frost tonight. Um, well, Sunday night. It was 90-something earlier in earlier last week. Went for a walk and came back with some carob that I harvested out of the gutter. <laughs> um, this is a chocolate replacement, and it was free. So if you have this plant around you, harvest some. And we'll, we'll teach you how to deal with it later. I don't have time right now. It's over after. She's so puffy. I think that because she's molting, she probably has cold spots. <laughs> Look at all that white spot. You're molting. But she's puffing out the rest of her feathers, I think, to keep warm. 
It's supposed to frost tonight. You better stay stay warm in the coop. Manuel just dug out from underneath the waters and now they're all dust bathing in it. Look at that. Happy birdies. They do have a real dust bath right there. The saffron started blooming this week. Oh, so awesome. I'm looking forward to this. Usually it starts around Halloween. Turns out this came early. Guys, there's so much growing on this walkway. And I didn't even think about this. Look at that. Those are the first saffron of the year. <laughs> Looks like they came up a day or two ago. Very cool. I'll be showing you guys how to harvest that later. Hi. What are you doing? You got a scratch on your nose. You getting a fight? Took apart the brooder to give it a deep clean. Should have done this after the last bunch, but we're doing it before the next bunch instead. Um, also doing a design change. So I know you guys haven't seen this before. It's up on end. I know you guys haven't seen the video for this yet because I want to wait until I know it's working great. So you guys can build what I build if you want to and not have to rebuild it like I'm doing. So hopefully this idea is going to be the last idea. She just comes right out for pets. <laughs> Silly girl. So this is something I need to do. That right there is a new cane for the blackberries. And everything brown there needs to be cleaned out. <laughs> Probably do a video on that. Maybe soon. Please join me 6 p.m. Pacific time tonight. It's every Monday. It's question answer, community conversations. Um, and there's a lot of topics we can talk about. Everything homesteading related, everything foraging related, everything, um, anything we, any topic we, we want to talk about that's related to this channel, we can talk about it. You have questions, we'll do answers, we'll do discussions. All right, please join me. I hope you enjoyed this video and that you join me tonight. Have a great day.